Hello, hello, welcome in everybody to Little Kim's Gaming Corner. It is good to be back. Um, where to start? So, I hope everyone is doing good. I am really, really sorry that it took me this long to come back on here and stream. Um, and after vacation, after we got back, we, you know, took a couple days to regroup and just get a hold of ourselves you know what I mean because we honestly did not want to come back home because that's how good of a vacation it was but with that being said we actually went to San Diego and oh my goodness I I live in Phoenix Arizona so it was I think it was like 115 here when I left and when we got out there to San Diego it was like only a high of 70 degrees so it was really, really amazing. The weather was great. We played in the ocean. We walked a uh, boardwalk. We actually were at uh, Mission Beach. I don't know if anybody knows where that that is, but we were at Mission Beach. And we just chilled, hung out as a family, and we actually decided to stay an extra night. We were supposed to be back Tuesday, but we stayed until Wednesday. And I know that I was supposed to stream on Wednesday, but um, considering it is about a six-hour drive, plus having to stop for my kids when they needed to use the restroom or something, or because we, we brought the dog with us too, we had to let him out, and you know, but um, it was about a, a six and a half, maybe seven-hour trip altogether as far as coming back down here, but. Good thing we did come back down here because I am looking outside my window and it is raining, it is lightning, 
you may hear occasional thunder if it gets loud enough, but it's very s stormy here, and I thought tonight would be a perfect, perfect, perfect time to play Animal Crossings. I love playing Animal Crossings in, like, rainy weather. I don't know what it is. Like, it's just so soothing, so calming. It's just, just Bruce Brava. <laughs> But, um, I have a couple more of announcements. I'm sorry if I'm overwhelming anybody, if my energy is just too up there, but I'm really excited to be back on here. Um, I actually, let me grab it since I, since I'm looking at it. I got this city folk and my kids, my two daughters, actually, um, they have a Wii console, and I saw this at my favorite gaming store, and I decided to pick it up right before they put it on the shelves. I saw it sit on the counter, and I asked the guy, I was like, can I take anything off of, you know, off of here? And he was just like, yeah, anything that has a tag on it, you can grab. I haven't even put them out on the shelves yet, and I'm just like, okay, well, I want this. So I grabbed City Folk, and... This is going to be part of our stream. Um, I have Animal Crossing's population growing. The first Animal Crossing's for the Nintendo GameCube. That's coming. Um, my husband ordered that for me. And he also ordered Metroid Prime for the um, GameCube. So we will be playing some Metroid Prime on here as well. Um, I'm just really, really excited. Like, there's a lot of new additions that are coming to the channel. Um, but enough chit chat. Let's just get straight into the game because I'm really eager, eager to play. Eager, eager, eager. Um, I'm looking at the time. I don't think I want to play a night stream. I think I want to play a day stream. As bad as that sounds. Today's the third. Okay. Oh, after our last stream, I actually went back and I set... Oh, that one might be loud. That one might be loud. That was a big flash of lightning. Um, maybe. Okay, it's rolling. Um, what was I saying? I, I love stormy weather. I'm sorry. I get so, like, easily sidetracked. Um, right. Last time we played, um, after we got done playing, I actually changed the time on the Switch back to normal. So we can just, you know, since me being gone for so many days, it should have. And I don't, don't hold this against me, but it should have put everything back on track for us. Um, I'm just, I'm not going to change the date, but I am going to change the time because I do want to have a day stream with you guys where it's bright out, you know, it's daytime, all the animals are awake. So, um, nothing's open. Nothing's going to be open in the AM like that. Um, we'll do that. We'll do 8.55 AM. That should be nice enough, right? <laughs> All right, so let's do this. Let's play. Oh, man. Last couple of days have been really, really hectic. Really hectic. But I am, like, really, really glad to be back here with you guys. I'm just so, so happy. Also, really quick, I just thought about it. Um, I noticed that on Twitch, after a certain time, my videos will disappear. Um, my content will disappear on here. So I um, created a YouTube channel. Same thing, Little Kins Gaming Corner. And I decided to upload everything that we've done so far on there. Just in case you guys need to see something again. Just in case you guys missed something. Um, I'm going to be uploading everything onto there. I'm still playing catch up with it right now because we've done so many episodes of this. Right now on Animal Crossing, we are on episode 15. 
and I only have five episodes of Animal Crossings loaded to my YouTube channel so far. But um, don't forget to hit that subscribe button on the YouTube channel as well because there, there's going to be a lot of content coming to that channel, including this one and our, even my Facebook. All right. Hi, Isabel. All right. Good morning, everyone. Right now on Lily Bay, it's 8.56 a.m. on Saturday, July 3rd, 2021. Now for today's announcements. We have a visitor at... Yeah, we have a visitor staying at the campsite. Go meet our guests in person and find out more about them. Also, thanks to everyone's loyal patronage, Nook... Yeah business at Nook's Cranny is booming. It's going so well. In fact, the shop has outgrown its cur current footprint. A re- oh, Sorry. <laughs> um, a remodel is in the works to give our favorite brotherly business duo a few more shelves to stock. I don't know if you guys can hear that or not. That was pretty loud. <laughs> Sorry. All right, this shop will be closed tomorrow to complete the remodel. The drop-off box will also be unavailable. Oh, so that means we have to hold on to everything. So if you have any urgent buying or selling to do, take care of it today before construction begins. And with that, I'll get back to work supporting you and your enjoyment on, on our island. All right, so here we are. It feels so good to be back on here, to be honest. <laughs> Hello, this is Timmy from Nook's Cranny. We've sent a payment to your bank account for 1,416 bells for what you left in the drop box. Thank you for using this service. Hope to see you in the shop soon. Yes, you'll definitely see us there considering you guys are doing construction tomorrow. All right, we got a congrats, <laughs> little kids. You got a new room in your home. I sent you a congratulations <laughs> present. I hope you I hope you dec want to decorate your new room with it. Awesome. And we got a thing from the Happy Home Academy saying congratulations on our new room. That's right, we paid off. We paid off our our home recently. Let's get inside, change, refresh. Insane. Feels really good to be back. Oh, there it is. There's our room. <clears throat> All right, let's change our, out of our clothes that we've been sitting in for probably about over a week now. I want to say, yeah, it's been over a week. For sure. Let's see what we got. Our cat hood. Oh. I think we should wear that. What do you guys think? Bold aloha. Actually, I like this shirt. That is really cute. Oh yeah, it's coming together. Oh, I think I might have rain coming through my window right now. Um, flower? Nah. Black? Uh, pink? Oh yeah. Should we? I want to do those or those. Oh God, that's tough. I really like these because they have like an elegant look to them. Look, I don't know what it is, but they look really cute. But these ones. Oh, goodness. How about these ones? What about these? Uh, no, see, those are not. 
what I'm looking for right now. So it's either these or these. These. Okay, it's these. <laughs> it's that. All right. So what do we got in our pockets? Let's check. A velvet stool. Mariba? Is that a plant? It's something that we don't need. So, I'm just going to put it out there now. Um, because of the area that I live in, when there's a storm around here, and because it's summertime around here too, my power has a tendency to go out. So, if I stop streaming for some bizarre reason. Don't freak out. I'll be back on as soon as the electricity is back on. Because <laughs> it's, it's getting pretty... The lightning is actually... Like, it just looks like it's getting a little bit more serious every time I see a flash. So. Just in case anybody wonders what happened. What is that? Stone Stonehenge? See, it's been so long, I don't even remember. Oh my! Is it that big? Oh yeah, that's the thing that we're supposed to put outside. Okay. We'll take that. What's this? The cardboard box. Um, we can put our golden nugget away. Put that away. Oh, and we were also working on hybrids. I remember we got to check our hybrids, too, because maybe, just maybe, it might have rained since we um, played. There's a good possibility, because in my, uh, my personal town that I've been working on, it actually, it's been raining like crazy in my personal town. All right, let's go, let's start our checklist. bring this up on here. All right, so we got Frigga. I love her house, it is so clean. I'm so very happy you stopped by. Wanna chat? At last, the weekend has finally arrived. Although, I still don't have any plans. Wait, no. I mean, of course I have plans. I'm going to, um, devote some time to self-improvement. Yes, that's exactly what I'm going to do. Self-love is everything, guys. I love her thinking. Self-love. Not just self-improvement, but self-love. There's Phoebe. Oh, hey, Sparky, what brings you here? Let's talk. This island's got a ton of foods I've never heard of. I'm trying to come up with meals for as many as I can. I love meal prep. Especially when it's, you know, something that I like. All right, so that's when we started working on our hybrids. <gasps> KK is here. That's right, it's Saturday. All right, so we got Marshall. There's nothing like summer on Lily Bay. I'm just basking in it, Lilikins. All right, there's Bones. Aren't mornings neat? Let's talk. I'm going. I'm gonna go real hard today. Gonna play hard, snack hard, yell yip yip hard. <laughs> All right. Do I need another shovel? 
Yep, it's looking that way. So I am gonna go over here and grab another shovel. And before we end stream, we're actually gonna grab extra tools for tomorrow if I'm streaming tomorrow. Gotta figure out what I'm streaming tomorrow. Okay, so he's just explaining everything that Isabel explained. Just saying that they're gonna be under construction. See what else they got. I think we're good on flowers for right now. Oh, excuse me. Sorry, we were at the pool today. Kind of wore me out. Oh, a green teddy bear. I'll take it. We were in there and I forgot to ask for turnip prices. Oh, it's still rumbling. Mm. All right, let's ask for those turnip prices. It's morning time. And remember morning prices and afternoon prices, they are different. All right, the current price is 58 bells per turnip for now. All right, so we got 58 bells per turnip for the morning time. Since we're gonna be on here for a little bit, um, we may, we may get a, um, what time did I set it to? Yeah, we may see the prices for the afternoon. May. Well, that's not a very nice spot to put a fossil. Alright, there's one right here. So that marks two fossils. There's a lot of fossils around here in this one area. There's cicadas out, guys. We need to start catching cicadas, giving them some blathers, and make them freak out. All right, that's our third. Oh, and there's beetles. Do we have? Oh, there we go. All right, we caught a Miami, I'm gonna say Miami, stag. I think that might be a new one for us as well. Um, I should probably mark this down as a favorite. And I'm right in front of my addiction. <laughs> I need to um I need to fulfill my addiction really quick, guys. My shopaholic. Alright, let's go in the dressing room. We'll see what they got. They got the kitty shirts. Oh I like this one. For sure. And those pants. A caterpillar costume. Ultra no shows socks. Oh, I love those things. In real life, they feel really good. 
We even got some of these. Oh, I love those too. The high tops. I really like those. Then I'm going to go back in because I want something else. I want this shirt. I have a thing for purple. For some weird reason. And I think I'm going to take those or the whites. Ooh, maybe these. I don't know what it is. I can't deal with like like white pants unless they're like jeans in this game. Like I just can't do it. It's kind of weird. Bam. Yeah. <laughs> I don't think I'm going to do that. Sounds like someone's dog is yipping. Yip, yip, yip. Uh, I think I'll do those the high tops, the, the purple high tops. Purple, red, whatever they are. All right, so we fulfilled my need. <laughs> All right, so. Search the beach really quick. Oh, oh look, Nan's over there. You know what? Remember we built a bridge? I'm gonna go see that bridge. And then there is our hybrids right by that fence. I'm gonna grab this really quick. And I think that's our fourth fossil. Let me check. Yep, fourth fossil. And, well, there's probably gonna be more than four today for sure. We haven't played in a couple days. But look, guys, there's our there is our bridge. We did it. Look at that. Isn't that cool? So we were just setting some stuff down. I think the last time we played. Um, let's go over here and let's check on these guys. I don't see anything happening, and to be honest, I don't like that. We really need to uh, focus on this. Did we catch that? Uh, Madagascan sunset moth. Let's take a look. I don't even know if it's on our list. I don't even see it at the things that are catchable right now. Just like losing it. Is this a. I don't even think it's on here. Alright, well, I'm gonna have to type that in. So I'm gonna go to Critterpedia and Bugs. And that was a Madagascan. I literally don't understand why we have never caught it never caught it okay so we caught that guy did I let me see really quick what's that a Miami stag we have not caught that guy either so I'm gonna mark him down okay just want to make sure I got everything down. Water flooring. Oh, we already know that. There is a cicada around here. I 
And there's our little zen area. That's right, we uh, created this. So he's in one of the trees. Oh. This may be like kind of above me. I don't know. Maybe. Oh, okay. It was literally right on top of me. All right, let's check this out. Starry Sands flooring. That is new for us. Oh, there's a, look at that. There are cicadas everywhere. Let's catch one. And I know there's different ones because I caught some of them yesterday. So what is this one? A brown cicada. I'm not really seeing them on my stuff. That's really weird. I wonder if this thing needs to be updated. Let's see. No, doesn't need to be updated. Oops. <laughs> that out of the way that's really strange all right so critterpedia uh, brown cicada all right so he is also a first for us I'll look for my bottle as well because we're still on the hunt for that. Just gonna scope out top and bottom. Just pretty much go around the whole island and do our dailies. I'll do the rocks after we get all of the, all of our fossils because I have a feeling there's more fossils laying around. Oh, that's right, and someone's in our campsite today. So let's while we're over here, let's see who that is. Who's that? Poncho. Do you live here? Awesome to meet you. I'm Poncho. I just got here today and I gotta say this island's really nice. Feels perfect. I figured if I'm gonna test my limits, I need to get away from the comforts of home. Except I didn't know I'd end up homesick. Or a row machine? Well, Poncho, nice to meet you. Enjoy your sandwich. <laughs> so I'm gonna run over here really quick and, yep, see, I knew it. I knew there was one. There's always one that hides from me. Like, always. That is a different cicada. That means either today or tomorrow, or later today or tomorrow, it should rain. That is a giant cicada. Let's see. 
giant cicada. He is also new to the family. I hear a lot of cicadas. There's that little brown cicada down there. Just, oh, I scared him away. My bad. There is a lot of them. You see, there's two, be two a cicada and a beetle right there. And then if you look over here, there's another cicada and another beetle over there. There is a lot of bugs out today. Good thing we started in the morning because this is usually what happens in the morning. You get a lot of good stuff on bugs, like, you know, fish. I don't think we've caught that guy yet. All right. Earth boring dung beetle. And he is on our list. So he's brand new as well. Long locust. See if we caught one of those guys. I see nothing in here on locust. It's kind of weird that my tablet's doing this. Um, long locust. Oh, he was already caught. But you. Okay, let's see what you are. A grasshopper. I don't think we've caught a grasshopper yet. Just a regular. Nope, he's brand new as well. So let's mark him down. I think we should let go of the long locust since he was already um, caught. Did we catch the mantis yet? Let's see. Yes, we already caught the mantis. The only one that we need to look for, and this one's always challenging for me because I always scare them, um, the orchid mantis. It's the one that kind of looks like a flower. I hear a cicada. Oh look, he's eating ice cream. Well, hello, kid. What's the latest? I tried to be a good listener. You can talk to me anytime. All right, so let's mark him down. We talked to Nan. Remember, there's one animal that we're actually trying to get rid of on here, and it is... I forgot his name, but it's the gorilla. <laughs> Actually trying to get rid of him. Oh, you can hear him like eating, crunching. There's Mathilda. So good to see you, wee baby. Let's talk. Finally, I'll alphabetize my purse collection. Then I'll, oh, hello. I do hope your day isn't as busy as mine, wee baby. You sound very busy, Mathilda. Let's see. I think this is, I don't want to say anything. This might be Anacotti. Could be wrong. Oh my god, I was right. <laughs> All right, let's mark down Anacotti. Morning, didn't think I'd run to you this early. What's the latest? These are so totally some of my favorite clothes. Do you like the clothes you're wearing, Lilkins? Of course. 
I thought so, because the clothes you have on right now really suit you. When it comes to fashion, I know everything. Well, I'm going to come to you for my fashion needs then. She might be a fashionista, guys. Alright, Bones isn't home because he's too busy hanging out. Who's this? Kyle. Let's talk to Kyle. Let's mark him down. <gasps> he's building something. I wonder what he's building. Oh, Littlekins. Sorry, I was just doing a little DIY. I was in the zone, you know? Let's craft it. Glad you asked. I'm making a I'm making an iron wood clock. The recipe came to me in a dream. Do you want to hear more about it? Either the dream or the iron wood clock? Yeah, let's learn. Oh no, I've already forgotten my dream, but I have the recipe written down right here. You can have it. Thank you, Kyle. Give it a try, Littlekins. If you can make this, anyone can. He's actually turned out to be a sweet wolf from when we first met him. When we first met him, he was like really snooty, remember? Let's put this away so we don't hit anybody's house. This is Tom's house. Let's see how Tom's doing. He's actually our last person that we talked to. Hey, thanks for coming by. Wanna chat? I refuse to compromise on sleeping comfort. You can probably tell me that from my throwback race car bed. Used to be I'd toss in, toss and turn half the night. Now it's a quarter of the night at most. Well, that's really good though. You're better than I am, Tom. We are not talking to Boyd because I don't want... I just don't. Okay, so we're still on the hunt for our bottle. Did I get the money? Okay, so I need to mark that down. I did get that. I'll put that away. Still on the hunt for the bottle. And there's another fossil. Look at that. So we got our bottle. Let's see what that is. Decoy duck. We already know the decoy duck. I love the decoy duck. It's either I like the decoy duck or I just like saying decoy duck. Alright, so let's go see if we can find any more fossils down here. Nothing. Nothing, nothing, little nothing. Okay, nothing behind the houses. Not talking to Boyd because I really don't want anything to do with him. Alright, let's start hitting our rocks. We may need another shovel. May. Okay, so that's rock number one.
move that butterfly just came in and went out said hi and bye oops didn't mean to do that okay so that was our second one Our third. All right, got to mark that down. We got three more. There's one by my house. Yep, there it is. No! Not that. There we go. And it's a money rock. Yay! Alright, so two more. My arm's falling asleep. Alright, and I know where the last rock is. Just gotta mark down that one. And then the last one is up here. On the, um, I think the second level. If I can remember correctly. Oh, oh, it's on the other side. Okay, so right here. Well, it's close for comfort when it comes out to those flowers. And then there is our last rock. we have any visitors today as far as like red or you know except for KK KK is here so I must mark him down he's not even on the visitor tracker it's probably because he oh, excuse me it's probably because he comes every Saturday night events for July So, now that that's done, let's go turn in our fossils. Whoop. Oh man. Alright, 
let's turn these guys in really quick. All right, welcome to Lily Bay Museum. Da 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 da. Let's assess some of these things. And remember, we got to see what we don't have. Hopefully, he takes some of it at least. Yay. Okay. So, museum. And then we're already on fossils. So let's make the donation. What is he not taking? All right, shark tooth pattern. All right, there's that. What's the other ones? Oh, I think we completed one. And then, what's the other one? Parasaur tail. I think I s Parasaur. Oh, the tail. Okay, so for that one, we only need the skull. And that's pretty much it. So let's donate all of these guys. Looks like there's no duplicates as well, so that's nice. Yay! Okay, so I think we completed one dinosaur. From what I'm reading, we completed one. The rest of them we're going to sell. That's not the selling spot. <laughs> I'm gonna come in here and just sell stuff. We want to sell. I don't want to get rid of my panda bear. That's my panda bear. So, we already know these. Really no reason to have them. I don't like that. That goes outside. I think that should be it. Right. So it looks like we got some points too. We need to build these up too. For sure. See anything interesting? That is our Starry Sands flooring. a lot of stuff to craft we really need to start working on these but the problem is they require pearls I wonder if I can find out let's see sea creatures oh no Oh, okay, so all they have is a pearl oyster. Well, that sucks. Um, it sucks, too, because you, like, really, it's really rare that you find them. It's like, you always, like, have to be in the sea. So I guess we're going to be looking a little pruney today. 
because there's a lot that I want to do. And today is like a three hour stream too. And we've already been streaming for almost an hour. So we got two more hours to do. The last hour though, I have a special guest coming because today is special guest Saturday. So I do have a special guest coming in tonight for like maybe the last hour, maybe last 30 minutes. Um, but he's excited and I'm excited. He's been asking me like constantly when we're going to stream too. But yeah, I don't see anything on the just a pearl. So I don't think you turned one of those into the museum because it's not on here, which it should be. It really should be if it just came from the ocean. But we have some crafting to do. We have some of these to work on today because I want to get the ter all the terraforming stuff today. That's what I want to do. So. Um, we're going to take a 30 minute break. So I'll see you guys back here at 9.15. Yeah, 9.15. I'll see you guys back here at 9.15. Eat, drink, use the restroom, do what you got to do, even stretch. Um, but I hope you guys are enjoying everything so far. It's really, really good to be back and it's good to see everybody again. And um, after this, we will start working on our nook mile points we'll start with that as soon as we get done with our break okay so i'll see you guys in a little bit enjoy your break bye
cycle started all over again.
an inkling of the problem of sea slavery, but the level of depredation that I encountered has haunted me ever since. All right, everybody, Wel welcome back into Littlekin's Gaming Corner. I hope everyone had a nice break. Let's get back into our game. All right. So, as I said, before we took a break, we're going to start working on our, um, yeah, we're going to start working on that, <laughs> on our nook miles. So let's start working on our nook miles. Let's see what the list entails. Alright, so, chop down, or excuse me, not chop down a tree, grow a fruit tree. So, what I'm going to do grab one of these or two of them should I say two and then we're gonna go over to that the other side across the bridge and we're going to plant both of those guys considering there's nothing over here um, so I'm just gonna that's not That's where I want it, okay. We don't want to eat it, we want to plant it. Yay! And then one right there. There we go. 
Even though it said it in, said only one, I wanted to do the, both of those because there's something I actually wanted to do with the beach area. Um, catch three. Dive for three sea creatures. That is not what I wanted. I wanted this. Where? I'm just gonna move this up a notch. And maybe learn not to get it out of the way. I am weird and I have OCD. Everything has to be specific. Alright. We caught a moon jellyfish. Is that a new thing? Or did we already catch that? Uh, sea creatures. That is new. He's new. So, moon jellyfish. Grab this guy. It's probably like seaweed or something. Or an anemone, me, me, me. Yep, it's that. It's the thing that I can't pronounce. This one's on the move. That might be an octopus. So let's corner it like my husband taught me to do. Oh my goodness. This guy ain't playing. fast. Oh, we didn't want that, but I mean, that's our third one. Alright. Let's just get this guy cornered all the way to the other side of the map. Whoa, he did a switcheroo on me. Where'd he go? Switch up. I don't like how fast this guy is. Just gotta get him cornered, I guess. Oh, another switcheroo. He does not want to be cornered. I don't like this uh, sea creature's attitude. He's uh, very rude. I can't tell what that is, to be honest. Oh my gosh, we almost had him. Because he's doing a lot of switcheroos. A lot. Just gotta get him to the corner. Okay. Almost there. No! No! 
Okay, another moon jellyfish. All right, where'd he go? Gotta get him to the corner. Switcheroo! A giant isopod. Do we have that guy yet? We do not have him. He's new. Oh, he's fast. Yeah, very fast. All right. Let's collect our points on that one. Let's go get uh, 10 pieces of wood. Exactly what was I doing? Oh yeah. <laughs> I had a brain fart there for a second. Poof. I don't think we have another one of those. Let's double check. We do, yay. Okay, so that's nine pieces of wood. We just need to hit one more tree. Our ten. All right. Next up is sell five pieces of fruit. And is there something else? That, oh, we got something. Rough Hain. Uh, de island development is Nook Inc.'s goal. We need a lot of materials to make that happen. So we're giving away Nook Miles based on how many what. How much wood you've chopped from the trees. Wow, guys, we have hit the 500 mark. So the next mark is 2,000 pieces of wood chopped from trees. We, wow, we already hit the 500 mark. That is insane. All right, so we need to five. We need to pick. We need to sell five pieces of fruit. For this type of stuff, I like you know when it says to sell stuff, um, I usually just use the drop box. Sell as much as I can because it's for the points, it's not so much for the bells. So we're just gonna use the drop box for this type of stuff since we're already outside. got points for it because we still sold fruit. Alright, catch five bugs. So, let's grab this guy and let's go bug hunting. Okay, there's one. Where'd that butterfly go? Really? You. You. Okay. <laughs> I think that's two. What, what time is it? 
Okay, so we got about an hour and a half until turnip prices change. So we got to keep an eye out for that that stuff too. Oh. Okay. There's our third bug. And there that goes. Looks like we need to go buy another one. How much room do we have actually? Oh, we're fine. But we're, what we're not good on is that we need to get another net. burned from the chlorine today. We went to the pool today and I have a tendency to open my eyes underwater so I don't run into anything because when I was a kid I actually ran into a, the pool pole and that's how I lost my two front teeth. So now I keep my eyes open like every time. Pick of the bunch. You'll get Nook Miles based on the amount of fruit you've sold. Remember, if you sell our island's specialty fruits on other... If you sell our island's specialty fruits on other islands, you might be able to get a better price. Awesome. Okay, so what that means basically is, like, I think... I think our town fruit is pears in this one for for hours. I know mine on mine on my private town is actually um it's peaches. So say for example I go I go to my private town with our pears and I sell our pears over there and that's basically what they're talking about. You might be able to get a better price. Um, I'll basically get more for the pears than I would here on our island because it's not really a specialty fruit because it's oh, it's like a homegrown fruit, basically. Like it's it's part it's part of our home. But um, same thing goes. Here's my switch light. This is what I play on for my um my private town. Um my private town is actually called Peachville. <laughs> I wanted to give it a little, little bit of a fruity name like didn't want to <laughs> didn't want to call it like Appleville or or that one thing from SpongeBob Apple World. <laughs> I didn't want to do that. Um but I'm glad that we got peaches because I actually like peaches. Pears are okay. Pears are really good. You just have to make sure you get the right one. But, oh wait, did we learn something new? What did we learn? Ah, there's that um, ironwood clock that uh, Kyle taught us to make. Oh, looks like Nan is walking around. Um, let's see. Okay, so we have two more bugs to catch. And then we would be able to get... Um, our points for that. Oh, look, and there's our two bugs. Oh, well. I think those are actually worth a lot. Oh, and there, there is a tiger beetle. And then there's our five. Alright, let's collect our points for that. Sorry, I know I know they're called miles, but I just call them points. It's just easier for me to remember. I know what they are, but <laughs> just easier for me to actually say it. Alright, so now our next goal is to collect five fish. That's not how we're going to collect fish. There we go. That's better. Alright, so we got to collect five fish. Oh. 
Alright, fish. Don't be rude. We caught an anchovy. Let's see if we've ever caught an anchovy. Uh, Critterpedia fish. Alright, anchovy. A bitterling. I don't think we've caught an anchovy before. Nope, he's new. Alright, so anchovy. Let's see. Okay. Gotta catch four more fish. We caught a seahorse. He is also new. got an olive flounder. He is also new to the collection. And remember, whatever we're finding, we're, we're just going to um, turn it into blathers. And then whatever we don't turn in, we'll just sell it. Just to keep our pockets, you know, full of space. interested in catching is sharks. I want to be able to catch sharks on here with you guys while we're streaming. Let's see. Nope, there's nothing out there. This might be a clownfish? Seahorse? It's clownfish! <laughs> so, let's see. I want to say we did catch him. Yep. He was caught already. It's so funny how animals that have like their their eyes like on the sides of their heads, like they wear glasses and it's like not even covering up their their eyes at all. Caught a sea bass. I'm sure we've already donated him. Sea butterfly. Yep, a sea bass. And there that goes. And we caught our five. But, just for insurance policies. <laughs> As you can see, another one, a fish. So we gotta catch a carp, which those are actually found in the river. So let's go back to the nooklings. Let's grab, actually on our way there, let's, Let's donate these things that we found. I just want to give us some uh, pocket room. Okay. All right, let's make a donation. So we got duplicates of a j uh, moon jellyfish. But we can donate the rest of it, which are just fish. And then whatever else, we can just sell it. Put it in the drop box. Alright, so let's sell some stuff. I just 
really want to get this stuff. I'm just gonna sell like this stuff. Just to get it out of my pockets because it's actually starting to bother me a little bit. Alright, see? Looks a little bit cleaner. Oh, and I think we hit... Oh, we got one. Actually, already done. So, earn bells by selling items. So, we collected fi 5,000 bells worth of stuff. We've actually sold all that. Alright, so... Plant trees or shrubs? Good. Because we actually have a couple of them to plant. I think my dog is underneath the door whining. Alright, so there's one. Alright, so it looks like, so far from what I'm seeing, it kind of looks like our um, goals might repeat itself a little bit. So we're going to go in here and grab just like, you know, like um, stone axes or um, like fishing rods. Probably an extra um, bug net. I'm sorry, I'm kind of crashing here. I'm a little tired. Being out in the sun and playing in the pool today kind of just like ugh, did a toll on me all right so we got that let's get um let's get two fishing rods um let's grab I think I'm gonna grab two of these because we gotta chop down a train, so I actually have to craft something. All right, so let's see what we need exactly to craft um, an actual axe. Three pieces of wood and one iron nugget. Alright. So a good thing we have to chop down some uh, some wood. Like, you know, get some wood pieces. So it should give us, hopefully, you know, three, three of the normal wood pieces. See, two is right there already. So we're, like, the majority of the way there. There's our three. Now we need to chop uh, one more piece, and we'll we will um, complete that. All right, customize and I customize two items. Pop one balloon. Cut down one tree. Catch a diving beetle and catch a carp. Okay, so those first two, right here, these two, these are actually going to be found in the river. So, let's craft, um, we don't want the rescue service. Let's craft our axe. Oh, excuse me. Wait. Can't do that just yet. I need to go get I need to go get um iron nuggets. There's a lot of uh, dragonflies flying around today too. Um, let's see. Oh goodness. Oh yeah, okay. I need these. I am like the We're going to bring these out too. 
just in case. Should be okay. Sure, we'll whip up something to customize. Alright, so let's custom or let's craft this one. Let's see if we can keep crafting. I wanna see what else we can build because I wanna be able to customize it. We can do a decoy duck. Let's do a decoy duck. Okay, keep keep crafting. Let's see what else we can do. Can you? Oh, you can. But I don't want to build that. We can do that. But you can't customize it. That's the problem. That's something else we can customize. So let's go, let's go get some bamboo pieces. Those would actually, I think those two items. Let's see. Oh no, we don't want to chop down that. I just want to get the, let's replace that really quick because I don't want to chop down anything. I just want to, get um, the pieces. There we go. So three pieces of bamboo. If you can customize this, I think you can. All right, so we're done for now. Let's. Oh, wait! No, no, no! Stop! 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 Not right now! Not right now! Run! 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 And there's another one. So we got our balloon. Yeah, see, they're gonna repeat itself just a little bit. Um, I think we got a little bit more points for doing something else, but let's um, customize those two things really quick. Just wanna get it out of the way. All right, so the bamboo sphere. Oh, I'm in love with this. But I'm also in love with that because it has white flowers on them. Smoke cured bamboo, dry bamboo, or green bamboo. I like the dry, but I really like the white flowers. Let's do this one. Okay, we gotta customize one more piece. A decoy duck. Look at him. Where's the... There. I want this guy. The mallard. I think he would look good in our zen area. Alright. So we got points for that. Um, let's grab this. Chop down a tree. Now, if you leave the stumps where they're at, you can actually get some beetles that will come 
down there and just like sit on the stump. So we're just gonna leave the stump alone. And just uh, whatever. Oh, there's a diving beetle. Where'd he go? Ah! Haw. All right, we got our diving beetle. Look at that, we got three of them down already. All right. Let's collect those really quick. So our next item to do is catch a carp. So let's go place down these thing these two things that I customized really quick. And let's actually Let's hold this cuz that's what we're going to need to catch a carp. Decoy duck. I think we should put the decoy duck right here. No, don't lie to me. I know I'm chubby, but you know, it shouldn't work that way. There we go. There. And then we can put the bamboo sphere right on here. See what this guy is. Oil barrel. Oh no. No. Why? I'm not trying to make my place. Uh, no offense, but I'm not trying to make my place look like a construction site. We don't want to sell that. <laughs> I want to sell this though. Not that. And this. And these. And that. And that. Okay, we're good. Oh, the chlorine did a number on my eyes. Okay, so... Ah, a carp. We need to catch a carp. There we go. I hope you're a carp. You are a black bass. check something really quick. Alright. So... I don't see anything. Sorry if you guys hear fireworks in the background. People in the neighborhood are setting them off a day early. I'll never understand why. But whatever makes them happy, right? Alright, we caught a bluegill. I want to see if we actually registered him down. Alright, let's see. Bluegill. He is new. Okay, so he's new. We're going to keep him. Uh, looking for a cart. Alright, we just got to keep skimming the river. For the most part. <sighs> I'm actually gonna go this way and see if there's any. Nope, nothing by the waterfall. Oh, that might be. Go check it out. Ah, uh, okay. I really need to make this a favorite. All right. Don't 
don't move, fishy, don't move. Because I want to see what you are. He is rude. A very rude fish. You're supposed to see it. Love it. You know? That looks like a sweet fish. I don't recall catching this guy. Ever. He is also new. I really want to catch a carp. The next couple of fish we catch, if it's not a carp, then we're going to move on to the next one and um, see exactly um, what else we can do. Wait, 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 wait. Okay, that's a crucian carp. That doesn't count, unfortunately. We're close. Did I catch the crucian carp yet? Crucian carp is new. Now let's see if we can see the size of the carp. Alright, so it's a very large fish. And I've been looking in the wrong place. Apparently the carp is in the pond. Well. Where's our pond? There's one up here and then there's one down. Like, directly down. There is another balloon. We're going to grab that really quick. There are a lot of green balloons out. That's not bad. Not bad at all. <gasps> we got a candle. Is it a good candle? Please tell me it's not one of those old-fashioned candles. It is. Okay, that might be our carp. That looks like our carp, for sure. So rude. There's our carp. Alright, and we've already caught him before. I can't believe I was looking in all the wrong places for him. Alright, so we got 500 bells for being an island. It's all. <laughs> I'm not even. Something ologist. Basically, we're just expanding our critopedia. That's, that's all that is. Alright. Craft three things, talk to three animals, plant three flowers. Alright, so... Oh wait, do we have more to, to do? We do. Here's a win-win-win situation. Craft your own furniture, win. Enjoy your handiwork, win. Earn your nook miles for the furniture that you've crafted, win. What could be better than that? So we have crafted 50 pieces of furniture so far. And we got 500 points for that. I think that's about it. Okay, so we are going to... Actually going to put this away and we're going to go diving again. We got to get three things. We caught a Gazami crab. I want to say that we have caught him already. Yes, we have caught him already. So, two more. Hi, love. 
Yeah, I'm crashing in here. Pretty bad. Hi, Poppy. He's fine. We caught a sea pineapple. I think we did register that one. Sea. There's seaweed, sea grapes, sea cucumber, a sea pig, sea urchin, sea un really. Yep, we already caught the sea pineapple. So we need one more. Oops, wrong button. And we caught sea grapes. And I think we already have that one collected. Yep, we already have it collected. So we have one more hour until we can um, ask the Nooklings about the, um, about the, um, oh Lord. Turnip prices. <laughs> yeah, that took me a fat minute. Take our sweet time getting over and over to the beach. fully over to the beach. Um, let's collect. Mr. Bean, what are you doing? Yes, I call my chihuahua Mr. Bean. He is adorable. What are you doing? What are you doing? Want everybody to see you? Want everybody to see you? This is my baby. He's my emotional support puppy. He's a good boy. Yeah. Oh, you just burped in my face. Pio. Pio puppy, Pio. Here you go. There you go. Go burp in someone else's face. What? Usually when I'm playing Animal Crossing, it's like on my personal town. Sometimes he would actually lay in the bed with me and just you know, be there. He loves to cuddle, especially underneath the blanket. All right, so, we gotta plant three flowers. So we do have to go in here. We don't really have a choice. Oh, it's raining again. All right, so let's check out the flowers and see what they got today. Excuse me. I have a red lily bag. Do we have lilies on this island? I'm gonna see. I'm just gonna get like a bag of those and just call it a day. I wanna see something though. Um, let's go here. Flower breeding guide lilies. Okay, so I guess if you get two lilies from the bag, it can either come out with black lilies or pink lilies. So we'll get something out of that. But I definitely want lilies on here because Lily Bay. But I also want the frog lily because she's adorable. Kind of hoping that I get that. <laughs> All right, so, all right, yeah, we do have lilies. So I am going to actually, I'm gonna do this. There we go. All right, so I am just going to bury them, just plant them, you know, in my little thing that I do, the little order that I do. I want to see if this, all reds, is more effective than 
what I'm doing up there in the corner. Because if it is, then guess what? We are changing up our methods. Alright, so let's water these guys. See if a good outcome comes out of this. If nothing grew over here, it kind of makes me wonder if it actually rained when I was on vacation. Because the way it's looking, I don't think it rained at all. Oh yeah, and we're trying to get purple, purple roses, remember? In my other town, I actually have one purple rose. Should I say in Peachville? I should start saying that so you guys know. In Peachville, I have one ro one purple rose, and I actually have to start the breeding process. What I have a weird feeling I am going to end up breaking this thing eventually, soon. Just last me until I can get to the mums, please. Liar. <laughs> um, I thought what what is what does all white mums do? I forgot. Mums. Purple mums, that's right. They give us purple mums. And if we get two purple mums, we can get a green. We can get a green mum, which that's actually what I've been after. Poppy, what you doing? What are you doing? No. No. You can't tell me the business right now. It's not fair. No. You can't tell me right now. Um, I hear a balloon somewhere. Alright, let's see. Oh, it's a yellow one. That me that might mean it's bells. Maybe. A low screen. Not bad. See? Look. Beetles. See? And this is a citrus... Citrus longhorned beetle. Alright, let's go here. Let's go to our bugs. There he is. Citrus longhorned beetle. And he is new. He is available all day, all year, except for when it rains. He does not like it when it rains. Poppy, what are you doing? Okay. Let's get this. Oh, and look, we get to change our outfit, too. Uh, now we got to talk to three animals, so let's do that. What's this? Renovation notice. Thanks to your support, we're we're going to remodel the shop. It will be closed 4th of July so we can carry out renovations. So convenient. What are we playing tomorrow anyways? I need to look really quick. Because if we're doing something on the 4th of July, live right now. <gasps> okay, guys. So we have our coffee and chat tomorrow morning at 11.30 to 12. And then 9 o'clock tomorrow night, which is perfect. We can, um, we're going to be playing Animal Crossings. So... Guess what? I'm gonna load up on some sparklers in this game and we're gonna be weird and just, you know, 
light them off tomorrow. Alright, so let's talk to three villagers. Let's re-talk to Frika. So happy you stopped by again. Wanna chat? My dear, I need your opinion on something, and do be honest. When it comes to selecting a home, what is the most important thing to consider? Location, cost, the neighbors. Location. Yes, I see. I couldn't agree more. Location, location, location. I've heard a certain real estate tycoon we know we know say that very same thing i'm not exactly sure but i think it means you want a home in a fashionable neighborhood of course i would accept nothing less a fashionable neighborhood huh oh she's using the restroom thank god we're leaving <laughs> All right, so two more animals. Let's we'll talk to two more people. There's Phoebe. Talk to Phoebe. Come back for more, huh? Must be my winning personality. Let's chat. Ugh, I totally forgot to water the flowers my dad got for my birthday. Got me, right? Go, go me, right? <laughs> I really should have been more careful, but at least they left a ton of seeds behind. I'm gonna replant them, and this time they're gonna flourish, or my name, my name's not Phoebe. I love her determination. She keeps to herself a lot, but her determination is, like, really good. Let's see. Um. Let's talk to Anacati again. I can talk to her again. Poppy. Hey there, welcome to my humble ab abode. Cannoli. Let's talk. Oh yeah, little kins. We get the results from Happy Home Academy tomorrow. I'm feeling pretty good about my interior design this time. The only thing I'm worried about is if the judge will, you know, understand my style. Alright, so we talked to three animals. Okay, something new just popped up right here. So we got Redeem Nook Miles and then Complete DIY Project. So we got to build three things. So let's get out of here and do that. I don't know where my dog went. He's somewhere in here. Alright guys, give me one second. I'm actually going to let him out of my room. get him out of my room. He likes to go underneath my bed and mark up things. And I actually had to clean it up recently. Alright, so we have to build three things. Do I have my... Actually, let's go to the museum really quick and empty out our pockets because I know we have stuff to donate. Okay, 
right, so let's make a donation. So it's not that much, but you know, it's getting there, honestly. All right, so since we're in here, let's take a look and see how, how you know, decently sized our collection has gotten since we have um, started, you know. There's our cicadas. Our beetles. Dragonflies. I think this is to the butterfly room. Let's see what the butterfly room looks like. Those are wharf roaches. There is our. There's our locust and our grasshopper, just hopping around in there. I know um, one of these is tarantula and the other one is scorpion. So I have yet to catch that. I, did we catch it? Let's see. I'm not even sure. We did catch it, so where is it? Or did we not turn it in? I don't think we turned him in. For a light mouth fireworks out there. I think he's still in our... Oh, look. That's awesome coming together. I love it. Alright, so it says that we caught the scorpion but I think we've actually put him in our storage to get him out of the way because I think the I think the museum was under construction. And I kind of just left him there. So, let's go check it out. Let's see if I accidentally neglected our scorpion. Where did he go? Did I accidentally sell him? There's a good possibility I accidentally sold my scorpion. I swore we donated him. It's saying that we did, but why is he not there? Well, I'm gonna have to unmark that then. Alright, there we go. It says we did the flea too and bagworm, so I think these are the ones where I didn't turn them in. Nope, it was just the bagworm I didn't turn in. 
It's a bagworm blathers, honestly. Yeah, I, I just did that. I'm not gonna read all this. I just did it because I like seeing the expression on his face. He looks disgusted. <gasps> Nothing. <laughs> Alright, so... Man, that stinks. I really thought I donated him. Mm. Alright, let's see. What else we got? That's right, we gotta craft three items. craft three items. Let's craft a bird bath. Alright, there's one. I don't think we have a bird bath. We can craft that. A silo. Silo, silo. but I really like the decoy duck. I don't understand why I want to craft the decoy duck again. Let's craft a water pump. And we're done. Since we're already inside, we're going to change our outfit. So we got to get out of out of our um, wetsuit. So let's change it up a bit. Let's do this. Wait. Where's the other one? Oh. That's cute. Now, of course, with a new outfit, must come a new hairstyle. I think that, yeah. All right, look at that. We are, yes. All right, we already have these. Okay, we'll take that with too. But I'm gonna go and empty out our pockets and, you know, Keep doing our thing. Okay. I really like our outfit. That is like the cutest outfit. Alright. Ooh. 
I should have stayed inside. I have stuff to put away in my storage. Let's just put this stuff away really quick. That way I don't sell it. Um, pretty much everything else can... That can't go. I am going to... Put this away. Um, put this up here. Sorry, I'm like really reorganizing everything. Um, that stays. Low screen can go. The sea low stays. The water pump stays. The candle can go. The fish can go. Um, that stays. The barbell can go. We'll just put it down here. Um, that can stay for sure. That ain't going nowhere. That's gonna stay. Uh, the panda bear can actually be put away. This can go. And the bird bath can stay. So everything in these two rows, they are going to go. Alright. Oh, Anna Cotty is out roaming around. So let's just get rid of this stuff. All right. So we did this. check something really quick because I let's see okay one flint and then one piece of one iron nugget so I'm definitely going to need an iron nugget because I apparently are one of our things is to water um eight flowers and since it broke <laughs> we're going to need to buy another one and then we're going to have to build it into a stronger watering can. Thank goodness these guys are remodeling tomorrow because the tomorrow's remodeling, like when we, I think when we play on Monday or Tuesday. Oh, excuse me. When we play on Monday or Tuesday, they'll be open. And we'll be able to, you know, actually buy the full watering cans instead of building them up the way we have. And I know it's like the lazy thing to do. I, I'm sorry, but it's usually how I do it. Alright, so I need one iron nugget. Let's see. And with that being said, we get 13. This guy down. Let's craft this guy. Let's pick it up and then let's go um, water our flowers. So 
there is a total of six here. Just water these right here. That sh that should be nine. So what is that? Oh, that's Poppy. <laughs> All right, so let's collect these. All right. Um, I really don't want to spend anything. Uh, I'm trying to build this up for a reason. I don't want to spend anything, but we get points for for doing it. You know what I mean? Gotta spend at least I think 500 miles. I really don't want to though. Well, hello there, little kids. Your home is now another. Your home now has another room where once there was none. You can use it for whatever you like. What brings, which brings us to the cost of your remodel. That'll be three, 348,000 bells. Ah uh, yes, please make your payments using the next stops uh, ABD feature as you've done before. Take him. As always, you've been, it's been ever so nice doing business with you. Yes, yes. I don't want the torn pants. All right, so let's check this out. We get 50 points because we're back on that schedule again. So let's redeem Nook Miles. I really don't want to, but... I mean, I guess we can see what they got. We have to redeem at least 500. Okay. If I'm gonna spend my Nook Miles on anything, it's gonna be one of these. It's going to be the cliff construction permit or the waterscaping. So, whoever is watching this in the chat box, put which one you guys want me to buy. Because if I'm gonna buy anything, it's gonna be one of these guys. So, either cliff construction or river construction put it in the chat box of what you guys want me to buy hubby bear says cliff construction Did I already buy the path thing? I think I did. Okay, so we're just gonna uh, do cliff construction like the hubby bear said. So that's gonna be 6,000 miles. Now I can do cliff construction with my island designer app. Awesome. We only got 200 miles back, but the, th the cliff construction was one of the things that I was saving up for. So, yeah. Let me 
those. Nope, I don't have any more of those. Alright, so what do I got? I'm actually gonna go put these things down really quick. There's KK. Heavy Bear, if Sean or uh, Matthew are still awake um, here in the next couple minutes, I'd like them to get ready to do um, special the special guest Saturday event with me. Pretty please. So I'm gonna snag some pears really quick. I found a perfect spot for something. Well. And there that goes. I think I'm in the way, but I am going... To, okay, right here is good. Where is... There it is. Boom. Okay, so... Yeah, that looks good. Keep it there. And then do like a... I don't want to put the bird bath there. That looks stupid. or CeeLo right here. Yeah, about there. So I have a lot of things in here. Um, the only thing I really need to put down is the bird bath. So I'm gonna go find a spot really quick. Maybe even by the uh, Abel sisters. Put the bird bath like right here. Yeah, that looks nice. Sorry, my arms are going numb. It's been a minute since I played. All right, so I'm just waiting for my special guest to be fully ready. said if he's getting ready then maybe just maybe I should be getting ready too shows how tired I am hubby bear brought me a drink an energy drink and I haven't even touched it yet all right so let's say I want visitors Daniel he's gonna be on local play We'll do local play. Yes, we want to fling them open. We don't want a dodo code. Yeah, 
Yeah, gates are open. And yes, they can come in here if they need to. I know the reception isn't the best as far as local play. My apartment's pretty big, so last time me and my hubby tried to do this, he was sitting at the table and it just didn't work out. You guys ready? You guys can chill on the bed. Uh, gates are open. It's under Lily Bay. All right, so my two special guests of the night are my son, Matthew, and my brother-in-law, Sean. And I have two tonight instead of one. So it makes double the fun. So we're going to be doing this for like 10 minutes, okay? Here comes Sean. Do you really have to wear that mask? <laughs> okay. <laughs> no, it just it looks funny. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, Matthew, go ahead and try to come over. Alright, Sean, you can uh, do shopping and stuff like that if you want to. Go uh, mess around. Let me see. Helping my son out really quick, trying to get over here. All right, there you go. No, in this one it's pears. But I have every other fruit on the island already. Alright, so my son Matthew just showed up. Uh, Matthew, you can, um, yeah, don't run my flowers over though. Stay out of the uh, breeding area, please. But, um, you guys can uh, shop. Talk to animals. Uh, KK is actually not performing right now. It's not six o'clock at night, unfortunately. It is. Yeah, it's. The windflowers? Do you want them? Take them.
um, it's just randomized. Bamboo I Island or any mystery island is just ran random. Do you have enough Nook tickets? I have like three if you want them. Yeah, like anytime you want to go to a mystery island, you have to have a Nook ticket. You take too long. <laughs> Gosh, Sean. <laughs> so I'm gonna need two shovels. Cause tomorrow the shop is getting remodeled. What are you in? What is that? It makes you look fat. <laughs> I can see your pooch. <laughs> I love your outfit. That looks good. See, why can't you be stylish like Matthew, huh? See? Look at this. There's cat shirts in, in, in the store right now. come out looking fashionable <laughs> so I'm gonna sit out here and I'm gonna wait for Sean Sean and see if he actually comes out fashionable. Backpack is that Matthew? That has a duck on it? That's cool. Where'd you get that? Really? It's cute. What skirt? You mean that one shirt that he was wearing? You know what? <laughs> It's not cute. You're pretty much half, like, partially naked. He's naked. <laughs> His apron. No, I don't care what that is. He had no pants on. I'm trying to be a perv. <laughs> Sean really likes to just, you know, wear no pants at all. None, no pants. It really does, that shirt really does look like it has just a skirt and no pants. Well, why don't you tell that to your brother because he's commenting on it right now. Sean said, why are you looking? <laughs> Oh, he said in real life, too. He's seen it in real life, too. He said, shut up. <laughs> Daniel, you should come in here and settle a score with your brother. <laughs> he says he, he thinks he looks really good. Oh my god. <laughs> Do you see his hair? Oh my gosh. You look like Little Miss Muffet. <laughs> you look like the old lady that gives away cookies. Yes, baby girl. 
Yeah. I do like the outfit though. The outfit looks really good. Oh, well, this is what I think of his outfit. <laughs> Oh, God. That's not what I want to do. I want to see what other emotes I have. So I got greetings, pleased, joy, delight, surprise, mistaken, sigh, sorrow, cold chill, sit down, uh, wave goodbye, ta-da, <laughs> um, excited, here you go. Oh, look, yoga. It's a. Uh... Oh, excuse me. Oh! Did you see Daniel's comment? He said, looks like a uh, bedhead. He woke up like this. <laughs> oh, he's getting angry. Do you see that, Daniel? Look what you did. <laughs> Yoga should. You could get it by buying buying it with your nook miles from redeeming. Mm -hmm. Huh? No, I have enough red flowers. I don't know if you could tap into it here. Daniel asked if those are bean buns on your head. He says they are. He says he saves them for later. <laughs> Some bean bones. Yeah, leave them alone. Are they red bean? Yes, they are, Daniel. They are red bean. <laughs> and he said only you would know. <laughs> I think so. Oh my goodness, man, I am tired. Oh my gosh, Daniel said he's a little hungry. <laughs> he said he has some buns for you if you're hungry. Y'all are sick. Daniel, if you're hungry, there's food in the kitchen. Leave Sean alone. Oh, did you see the Zen area? It's not really, I'm not really done with it yet. That is a hearth. Bamboo. Daniel gave those to me. He did. How many what? I think I should have ten. Oh. Daniel said, you nasty little bro. response. <laughs> so I got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I have ten animals total. And that's the max that you can have. Mm -hmm. You haven't even gotten KK yet? You! Oh really? Or did you have some animals like move out?
You owe me some black tea. Wanna chat? Having something tailored. Bravo, littlekins. Do you ever talk much to Sable when you're in there? She never seems to want to engage with me. Daniel, what happens if you talk to Sable? Like, I forgot what happens. Does she give you stuff? Like the last one? Oh, sorry, I'm a little busy right now. I like that. I like that space cloth that she's working. She gives you fabrics to customize. Oh, that's right. And then a new leaf. Um, she gives you what mannequins? I think gives you the mannequins. You have to talk to her every day. Okay. For how long? Oh my gosh. You should have gotten this one, Sean. <laughs> this one, the yellow. Did you really? <laughs> huh. Uh, yes, it's a uh, poncho. He's a cute little uh, bear cub. Yeah, go talk to him. He might actually want to move to your town. You can actually do that. That's Marshall. That's one of your dad's favorites. Phoebe. Hey again, you keep checking up on me today. Let's talk. Tomorrow's the day the folks from the Happy Home Academy come to visit. The bugs on the floor always get excited when the Happy Home Academy comes by. I wonder what score I'll get. Hopefully a good one. Yes, that's Bones. Aren't they aren't the sharks available at nighttime? I actually wanted that's actually I think what our next stream is gonna be. Um it's gonna be a night stream where um we try to catch the shark. Ooh! A knife jaw. I don't think I I have one of those. Uh no. Everyone needs a turn. Let me see. Oh. He's new. Yeah, use the clams. Uh, the manila clams for uh, make fish bait. Daniel, do you know what time the sharks are available? I know it's nighttime, but do you know actually know the time? It should be available in the nook shop, uh, in the, in the nookling store. Okay. No, he's not. He doesn't perform until 6. And we are, like, really far away from 6 o'clock. No, we won't. guys yet? Nope. The puffer fish is new. I'll 
day for the whale shark. Okay. Thank you, hun bun. The sea bass are like really annoying. Oh my gosh. The puffer fish looks so weird when it's skinny. <laughs> yep. Just put it, leave it on my island and you can come back. sea bass. They're like literally not even worth it. Okay. <laughs> Caught this guy today. That is Mathilda. She's cute. She's really nice too. After 12 o'clock, so I'm actually going to go into the Nooklings and I'm going to check the turnip prices for the afternoon. Because they are different from the morning. So they went down, looks like 10 bells. So this morning's turnip prices were 58 and they went down 10. So. Where'd Sean go? Catch a horse mackerel. Oh, really? Ooh. I caught a zebra turkey fish. <laughs> you what? Yeah. Oh. 
There it is, the horse mackerel. I guess the piranha is actually available to catch. Where is he located? He's located in a river. Hmm. I don't know if I have the horse mackerel yet. I want to say we did get it. Wow, seahorse. Amazing. <laughs> Mackerel. Nope, we already got the horse mackerel. We got the horse mackerel and we got the buoyants. What is it? Oh wow. Uh, let me see. I can find that out for you. It is worth 3,000 bells, Sean. A pot of honeybee? Yeah, I did. Now I just gotta catch the wasps that fall out of the trees. No, I donated it here. Oh, I forgot. I need to drop this stuff off. Off of Alright, we got 20 minutes left. Or 20 minutes. We got 5 minutes left. Yep. And then I'm gonna end the stream. Because mommy is getting tired. Alright, so I'm gonna put my. I'm going to put these guys away. Yeah, I got a decoy duck. I love the decoy duck. You steal my decoy duck, you better replace it or something. No. Can I make another decoy duck? Because I can make another one if you want one. Alright, yeah, I'll make you a decoy duck and we'll even color it. You want to color it? Okay, it looks... Oh, that's what happened. You need to get out of my house, Sean. <laughs> I was trying to uh, put down my uh, workbench. That's stupid, though. It doesn't let you put down stuff when you have company over. Like, I just think that's stupid. Alright, so the one decoy duck. Now let's change the colors. Customize it. Decoy duck. Alright. There's that. Uh, spotted. Spot build. Like, that's like a grayish black. The common. Uh, steamer duck. Or just the duck. Yeah, only because it matches with my um my Zen area. Are you playing your little thing? <laughs> All right, there you go, Matthew. Ha <laughs> ha 
I think those glasses look so weird, Sean. <laughs> oh, we're all wearing like sunglasses. Hell yeah. <laughs> I don't have one of those. I can craft one too. Yeah, I can craft one too. Keep it, I'm gonna craft one. I wonder if I can customize it too. Don't be rude. <laughs> All right, I just took a picture of our festivities. <laughs> That's Matthews. KK Slider and the votes. Oh, I love you, Hun Bun. All right, guys, it's time to wrap it up. Come on, let's go. Until we return. You and your yellowness. <laughs> It was actually a cute outfit, to be honest. That was actually really cute. Really? Yeah, you will. You guys will be able to come back again. Really? I like Daniel's town. Have you seen his flowers? I love his flowers. Like, it looks so pretty. Oh, really? I think he heard you. Oh, uh, because I changed the time. I wanted to do a daytime stream.
Yep. Thank you, guys. <laughs> I loved your hot cross buns. <laughs> Gosh, I love my brother-in-law. He is hilarious. All right. With that being said, and it being almost... <laughs> oh, <laughs> yeah, you heard that, didn't you, babe? With it being about 11.20 at night, I am severely crashing, as you guys can probably see it in my eyes right now. Um, we have been streaming for about three and a half hours. It's definitely bedtime for me. I'm just like half dead. <laughs> so I hope you guys enjoyed the stream. It felt good to be back. It felt good to stream, be here with you guys. We actually made some pretty decent progress. We got um, the cliff construction um, app for that. The next one that we're going to be working on is our... Um, like the to uh, do construction like on the rivers and stuff like that so that's going to be our next goal and then so on so forth um tomorrow is fourth of july oh tomorrow's fourth of july before we go we need to go no we don't need to sit down we don't need to sit down get out of there <laughs> we actually need to buy hopefully they have them like sparklers or something <laughs> buy a whole bunch. Because I know sometimes they have them. That was one thing I actually... Oh! Okay, we'll take the party poppers. We'll take about five of those. And we'll take some noisemakers. Tweeter! <laughs> Alright, we'll take one tweeter. And we'll take another five of these. I know it's not fireworks, but they make noise. So, they're party poppers, so they make popping noises. And a lot of confetti goes everywhere. Okay. So, I hope everyone enjoyed the stream. Uh, tomorrow is 4th of July. Um, we will be streaming, I think it was 9 o'clock, 9 p.m. And with that, um, we'll see if... Mm, Nook's Cranny is going to be closed tomorrow. I may fast forward it a day. And we'll just celebrate it as if it's 4th of July. But... We're gonna keep the nighttime time frame because, like my husband said, the sharks are available between 4 p.m. and 9 a.m. And I actually want to try to catch a shark. I want to try to also catch or re-catch the scorpion that I more than likely sold. <laughs> so that was my fault. But um, there's just a lot of things that I want to do with you guys on this stream and whatnot tomorrow, but things are just gonna kind of be a little different as far as the day, because I want this to be open and I'm kind of hoping that we can get like sparklers and like little a little firework thing. But I hope you guys enjoyed the stream. Please don't forget to hit that follow button on my Twitch page, Littlekins0427, and that follow button on Littlekins Gaming Corner for my Facebook and don't forget to subscribe onto my new YouTube channel at Littlekins Gaming Corner as well. Um, I will be uploading as much as I can tonight um, as far as like our streams from pre previously but um, it's just it's just a little it's like gonna take a minute so but I will do as much as I can tonight but with that being said I hope you guys have a good night and I'll see you guys tomorrow bye